What's going on guys, Ness here. Today, I'm gonna be taking a look at the V18 Gaming Mouse by Easy SMX. This mouse is in the budget category, costing about 10 US dollars, but it comes with a load of features, so I thought I'd take a look at it and see if it's actually worth buying. Now, I've reviewed some Easy SMX gamepads in the past, and they were pretty good. Let's see if this mouse holds up similar to those. Now, opening up the box, we have the V18 itself, Nice little red and black color accents. And a set of instructions. Pretty basic packaging right here. The V18 comes with left and right clicks, a fire button over on the left, a sniper button over on the far left side, a DPI increase and decrease button in the center, as well as a forward and back button in the middle left. It comes with a threaded USB cable, and just overall has a pretty solid build to it. The V18 has a max DPI of 4000, but can be reduced all the way to 400. One of the first things I noticed about the V18 is that it's actually pretty lightweight, despite having five removable counterweights on the inside. This might be a good thing for some, but me personally, I prefer a heavier mouse. The edges have rubberized grips, and the red on black actually matches my PC, which is really cool. It also illuminates red when in use. Using it to play Fortnite, the mouse felt smooth, responsive, and every bit as good as a mouse of a higher price point. Playing Fear of the Wolves, I had no issues with the mouse at all. It ran smooth and executed perfectly. Using it to play a more fast-paced shooter like Quake Champions, the differences between this and a more expensive mouse became apparent. It was still perfectly usable and perfectly functional, but I just felt a little off. Playing Apex Legends was probably the most enjoyable experience I had with this mouse. It felt extremely comfortable and with the placement of the buttons, I had an even easier time pinging than what I normally do. The overall shape of this mouse made it an extremely comfortable experience, even more so than the mouse that I'm currently using. So that is pretty much it. The V18 by Easy SMX. Honestly guys, you really can't go wrong. For $10 here, you're getting quite a lot. I feel like as an entry level mouse, or even a spare mouse to take with you on the go, this thing is absolutely perfect. If you guys are interested in the Easy SMX V18, I will put a link in the description below. Until next time, this is Ness, signing out.